We're on. Awesome. Hello. Okay. Uh, last week we covered flip body strike. Today we'll be covering brush and punch. So, um, after flip body strike, from here you just simply shift back. But when you shift back, you pull uh, on this uh, fist with your hip. And as you pull it back, it comes to your waist. And as that happens, this other arm naturally moves forward if you relax it. And as it happens, you also pivot uh, your, uh, your pelvis and that naturally moves the foot out. So from here, you shift back, so first shift back, turn, and then you shift forward, you secure your weight, and then you step, and then you shift and turn. And as you can see, this hand is across the elbow, and the fist is vertical. It is not straight, uh, it is vertical. And the forearm, the top portion is perpen uh, not perpendicular, parallel to, uh, to the floor. Now seen from the front angle, One more in the side. And now to the application. Joe is actually the <laughs> cameraman today, so Joe, if you uh, would uh, do us the honors. Okay. Okay. So, last week when we were covering, uh, we were covering that if somebody grabs you across, you can simply go this way. So, now, from here, you can actually go this way, and then watch this. So, um, as you can see now, well, he already went, so, but sometimes they just let go of the hand. So, from here, uh, as you can see, you can come in and strike uh, straight through. So, this hand here is a guide and then the, uh, the other one just slides through. Now, the other way to look at it is if Joe gives me a punch, you can actually go this way, and then from here, come in and punch it. Uh, or, you know, you can go with the other, the other side. If he comes in this way, um, you can come in and then punch. Now, you always have to be aware of the elbow, so the movement goes like this, but you, you, will, you will have noticed that before I stepped in, I came in. So if you look at the actual flip body strike and then punch, you will see that there's an angle. So that's the reason why. So um, one other thing that people typically miss in these things is that this is really not necessarily just a punch. So you'll see this. So you're here, and then watch this carefully. Uh, as you can see, you actually do go on like this, and then from here, if you can move forward, as you can see, this move is actually also a joint lock. So from here, you can actually go in this way, and as you can um, observe, that becomes a joint lock move, and you can actually propel them away using that as well. That should be enough for today. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Um, now, how to practice flip body strike to um, parry and punch or brush and punch. Um, it's a very simple move. You can start from here. Go step forward and punch. From here, you can actually go and actually hold the ball again. And again, flip body strike and punch. So you can continue using that um, and continue repeating these two moves. So one more time from the back. Go step, 
step away from the camera so oh. we can see your feet. Thank you. That will be it. Enjoy.